Now we have to learn about the recesses of the liver. The subphrenic recess which is lying in between the diaphragm above and the superior border of the liver. Hence creating a potential space in between these two. So we can say it is the superior extension of the peritoneal cavity or greater sac. Right? And now the subhepatic recess. If I remove the liver, it is present here below the liver and you can say it is the supracolic compartments portion that lies just inferior to the liver. Right? If I put it back, you can find that this subhepatic recess lies here. Right? Now comes the hepato renal pouch or hepatorenal recess that is present posterior to the liver and I will show you anterior to the kidney and the suprarenal gland so called as hepatorenal recess or pouch let me put the liver again to show that it lies posterior to this liver and anterior to this kidney and suprarenal gland hence the name hepatorenal recess or pouch right or morrison pouch it is called and it is a potential space if a person is lying horizontally like this so the fluid of the lesser momentum can be collected here in this morrison pouch under the action of gravity right